Salutations to everyone. Today we will dive into the enamoring expressions of Heartland, a television program that holds an exceptional spot in our souls. Heartland, Canada's longest-running series, has established itself as a national treasure by enthralling viewers for an impressive 17 years and preserving its mature cast and fan base. Hurricane has defined the odds in an era when television shows face constant challenges to remain relevant. We should pause for a minute to see the value in its excursion. In 2007, when Heartland Post debuted, the entertainment industry was vastly altered. Web-based features were still in the earliest stages, online entertainment presently couldn't seem to develop as, and audience members had restricted choices. Even though there was production technology and the internet, it was not as advanced as it is today. As a result, television productions were less extravagant, with the film industry receiving the majority of the financial benefits. Hurrytown came into existence during this time period and has changed over time. In the present, we wind up in a brilliant time of TV with a flood of miniseries supplanting conventional films. Costs associated with production will rise as a result of this shift, as will competition and unwavering focus on quality. Despite relying on social media to peak interest, many insiders of the industry are having trouble navigating this new terrain. As a result, for television to remain relevant, it must adapt to rapidly shifting social media trends. So how has Heartland remained relevant amid the pervasive changes? The answer is straightforward. Heartland has resisted unnatural changes and adhered to its original premise. Heartland has managed to entice a large number of viewers by remaining true to its roots. Furthermore, the show has embraced imaginative techniques, incorporating organizations with famous streaming stages like Netflix, which have drawn in another age of fans close by its devoted existing crowd. The departure of Graham Wardrow, who portrayed the adored Ty Warden since the show's inception and played a pivotal role as a young man, has been a major setback for Heartland, despite its partners. At the Heartland Ranch, he found solace and a second chance from his humble upbringing. The viewers were moved to tears by Ty's growing relationship with Annie and his personal development throughout the show. In contrast to many relationships on television, this one was based on genuine friendship with love and respect, not toxic behavior. Fans were astounded and disappointed when Waddle abruptly left the show, leaving the storyline unfinished. While others persistently yearned for Ty's return, others even commended their support. In spite of these teas, Waddle stays steep past in his choice, leaving on an effective profession in podcasting, subsequently hurts, and needed to move forward without his presence. Fans continue to disagree about whether the show was able to successfully navigate this change. What if Ty hadn't left? What effect would his presence have had on season 17? Assuming Ty was as yet a piece of the series, we guessed that whole plot would have taken an alternate sad landscape. We would have seen the couple confronting the daughter, Lindley, rather than Anne's group, as she struggled to get back to life. They might have made significant life choices together, like buying a new home to meet their growing needs or growing their family. Ty might want to have dedicated himself to his vocation and sought after the improvement of his farm, lining up with Zach's conversation about the farm future beneficiary. Heartland's ranch expansion and business prospects would have been top of mind for them if Tang and Amy were the obvious choice. Additionally, Tang and Amy adore spending time alone and enjoying each other's company. Tending to the season's principal challenge of childcare would have been streamlined in the event that Ty had been available, as he would have had the option to really focus on Lindy while Annie kept an eye on different obligations. What do you think of T's possible appearance in season 17? Is he still a part of you? Does it still hurt and feel like that without him? And most importantly, are you looking forward to this remarkable series 17th season? We appreciate everyone's time to watch, and if you found this video to be of interest, please rate it and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Until sometime later, be careful and remain tuned for really thrilling news.